So, uh, so please download the assignment number four on your download folder. Need a download the last link, and maybe you create a folder. If you have a lot of files in that folder, create a, a new folder assignment four. If it's a blank download folder, that's okay. So just to avoid confusion between a lot of files you might have in that folder. So create a folder, assignment number 4, and download this file, data file. Once you download the file, so the file name is NYC CCMI georeferencing. Right click on the file and extract here. So what you see, I have given a three different files. So one, one file I give to you, supply data with the low resolution. Another folder is the shape file with New York City. And another file we have is the CC College map. So what happened? I just Maybe you can just 
drag up and down. So if you look at this uh, uh, image, it's perfectly fit on the your New York City map. You just turn uh, off and on the layer. You can see the road already on the behind that. Okay. You added two big files, let me see. Yeah. No, no, no. Go to go to layout. Yeah, it's a small file. Yeah, small file. I have the folder on download, but I couldn't find it. Yeah, that was really good. This is the second one. This is the second one. This is the second one. Thank you. I put it also on the USB, but I couldn't find it. So what's the cost of the cost? Put it on the... The .ax file. Right? Yeah. But not, it's not there. Why? 
Because the mother is not calling. No, no, what is it? Go back, mother of the mother. Go back, mother of the mother. No, no, I don't know. I'm saying I need to add something else. That's right. Yes, okay. Mother of the mother. So I need to add this one first? Yes. I need to check it out. Okay, you added the file? Where is the file? It's supposed to appear here, right? Yeah. But can you see where the file? Can you just go see in your map? Where is the file? Find out for me. Where the file goes? Is it the same I have now like this. This one here and then this one. Yeah, yeah, but third file you have to do that. One more file to add, right? Alright. Yes. Where the file goes? Can you find out for me? How to find the file? Last file in your map. Let 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 me give a couple of minutes. And those who come, I will find out file for me. It's a winner. No, no, no rush. No, I told you. For personal means you can submit tomorrow. You can submit Monday also. But focus on this because if you don't need to focus on this, you can go back. Okay? So focus on the current work, not the previous work. All right. Right click on the layers. I have a zoom point. Oh, zoom to layer. Zoom to layer. That's right. All right, so let me add this file here. Anybody able to figure out where the file is? No. No, okay. Let me show you a trick. Okay. Look at the screen. Everyone look at the screen, please. And add the data. Mother, add the file and add. Yes. And okay. I will back to this file. Whenever missing file. And zoom to there. This file is somewhere. Now what I will do basically, I'll, 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 I'll zoom out. And you will see this file goes here. This file is here. You see the dot? Because that file doesn't know where to go. The reason because that file doesn't know where to go. Other files know. Where should be in the extent? And our objective is to bring that file first here and make sure rearrange the shape, right? Properly to fit the map. Okay? <coughs> Everybody is here now. Anybody behind? Okay. So, so to do that, I will go back to do this layer. Go back this. So go back to the previous screen. I couldn't see the top. It's more one. It's on the side too. You have to reduce it. I did. So after that, what you do, right click on here, on top layer, and click on open the georeferencing toolbox. Right click on the georeferencing toolbox. Right click on the...
So please close your previous uh, assignments. Just focus this on because I don't want to come back again and help you. Okay? I can help you definitely. But again, it's a waste of time for me. How to get this window? All right. Right here. 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 Open your reference toolbox. Now, look at here carefully. Everyone, this file name is I reserved to your CC my image, right? Yeah. So I am telling this file as the file to display. I told the file to display. And that file is pretty to display now. Means I have some coordinates now. Now, if I turn off and on layer, does it fit exactly there? It's not coming no. on the same thing. Exactly like something like the same place. Turn off and on. Oh. You click here and turn on and off. And see, does it come in the same place exactly or no? Mm -hmm. uh, no, right? No. I need to do it. Do it again? Yeah, you go to Okay, now it's close, it's not very close, right? So, next step will be how to bring exact location at now. That is the step I'm showing. Are you able to bring closer to the fire at least to some extent? No, 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 it's not. I wasn't able to. Alright, listen, what? What is it? So, it's a Let me show you. Uh, okay. So right now, set up file, right? And click here. So go there. Okay. And on this file, you have two meter zoom. Turn on this layer, right? You want to? I know that file is all right now everybody able to bring the post to the file no only one left all right okay so this is the file is somewhere right so I know that file belongs to this area, especially this area, right? Okay. And then I next right click here, you have a file. I'll go right and I'll to this place. Okay? So now we on and up layer. There it is, good, right? Alright. So what I'm the first step here? So, so in this map, you must have seen some some fixed locations which then change. Maybe a stem and hall, 
Why? This is done all. All pick may be uh, NAC, this NAC building is existed in both the map. So one on the corner here and try to match those locations approximately close to there. Approximately close to there. Not exactly. Or is it level next to there? So, so if you look at this here, we hear the stem in all this place, but this in this map is here. So I'll try to bring this close to this, not exactly close to this. To the by printing to map display, okay? And so
Whole scenario, the map is turned twisted in a way. Because Manhattan, look at it, by the way, your Manhattan is not marked to solve. An actual coordinate, Manhattan is always tilted. But when you read software map or retail map, always see the Manhattan is not to solve exactly, right? And that we assume several years. I also assume when I came to America first time. The avenues are exactly not to solve. That's not true. The avenues are the Manhattan are from north. West to the then north east to the southwest. Okay, it's an angle. Turn. So, 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 man, this matter is not like this. Matter is like this. Okay, and this is the Brooklyn here and Queens. So this is true. Matter. Okay, just two reference. Because we always see the map like this. So we have any All right. I just pick the point based on the which is visible to me. So this corner is very much visible to me. This is visible to me as actual point. Yeah. Don't have to follow the same. But trying to follow the which is more far away from each other. I can help you. So maybe, maybe come here, I'll show you. Come here. So, so we're we're the government. 
give this a credit <coughs> or any folder you download your shared drive folder have your flash drive okay and then on top of the folder you click right click and new shape file so go to your folder where your folder download file and you now Uh, yeah. So, which one? No, yeah. Virtual folder you saving your data. Yes, exactly. oh, you. Right. So, so you can use your file and this app here. So what we are doing basically making polygons, right? There are three options. Either you can point or line or polygon. We are not doing rules. We are not doing any particular location of the volcano or, or any accident location or anything. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so, so first thing we'll do is everybody want to do this? Right click on this map on the right there. And then you create the same line. And then you start editing. And you start editing. You see, this is a select the map. This is a map. And just continue. And then you appear here on the right side of the screen feature, click the map. So let's finish up to this point and then I'll show you the next step. Do that, okay. So you create a new one, right? Yeah, Or how many of you done with the buildings? Done. No? Yeah, we have to build it.
15 length which is y. And click OK. And then again I'll add field. What does he want to add? What is building information? Maybe number of students coming to the building? Per day, average. Let's add one more field, number of students. What should be number of students? Integer or float or double? What did you get into that? You should do the same box. Add yeah. huh? Should we float, double or integer? Yeah. Or text? Sure. No float? I don't know. Float is just float. Float is float. 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 Okay, so should we short it here, right? We're doing short it The students. And you go again go back to the same place and add another field. Zero precision is okay. Yeah. Yeah. And another field you going to add maybe students, building name, faculty, or rooms, number of rooms. Let's say number of rooms. Okay. Should be short in here as well. <coughs> okay. So let's pull it. If you want to add one more field, maybe what you want to put in another field. Let's add one more field. Your suggestion to me. What is name, students, rules, and one more field of the add. What should be? Huh? Faculty? Okay, we'll add faculty. Okay. Our faculty.
Yeah, you did the part this one? Or, because I, oh, okay, I should name it. And then, I'm gonna... Because you should have that one should be shady. You could do the first one, you should be shady. So, uh, to show your labels, okay, go back to your lesson. Save, save edit, stop edit. Right click on tab, go properties, and labels. <coughs> Instead of label IDs, student name. Apply. Add any name, so let me add the name. So we can think about So we can think about So we can think about So I have only one pretty name to add the name. Oh, that's right. You don't have to do it? No, no, I just look at names and then the person needed to say everything else. You need to work with the end of the day. You need to work with the end of the day. You need to work with the end of the day. You need to work with the end of the day. Add. Add the end of the day. Add. Or should I just show it? Thank you. 
So, print something like this with all building names and uh, upload to the shared folder. Like, oh, I see. I guess it would work to be this, after this, that. So, that's what I can do.